I definitely just expect it to be what uh, everybody expects it to be. You know what I'm saying? Everybody looks forward to, I think, mostly the first game and then your rivalry game and then your last game being a senior. So the rivalry game definitely important to me and this team. It's a lot of hype, but we're not really going to buy into it. Just uh, really excited just to play the next game, actually. Like Coach Campbell said, it's it's a, the mat game. It's a mat game, and that's the most important thing. It just so happens that it's against our rival, so it is a little more important. But we try not to overhype it. And just focus on winning the next MAC conference game. I think we better first and foremost prepare for you know one their ability to run the football. I think they that's their number one thing. They do a great job of number two. You know certainly is is their quarterback play. You know they've gone with Matt for the most part, really, for the last you know, four or five football games, he's played the bulk of it. So I, I would have to expect that they've played well and they've got, they want him to handle the football right now for their football team. I think when you look at it, really, you, you talk, I think it's so big for the communities involved. And you, you got two, you know, two of the top programs in the Mid-American Conference, two that have tremendous tradition. Um, you know, I think the former players and the, and the universities in itself, uh, you can see why it's a great tradition and a great rivalry football game. And, you know, I think that's where you as a coach and a player, you got to understand that it still is the next game. And, you know, that's something that's why I think that model has been so big here, because, you know, I think if you if you get yourself too high or too low, that's sometimes when you maybe don't play to what your full potential can be.